All right, welcome to event one of a Zone 5 campaign. Today we get pretty simple 1 versus 1, 1 F14 versus 1 bandit F5E. So uh, let's see how this new BFM AI will, will do. See you on the range. Captain, who us up? Okay, Jester, let's start. Okay, Jester, let's start. ICS comm check. Can you hear me? Loud and clear. Roger. Okay, I like this. Looking good. First thing you should test. Instrument test. Chester, push button up. Arrival runway 21 left. Visual approach is in use. Advice on initial contact, you have information alpha. Looking good. Nellis information alpha. 1345 Zulu. Wing 210 at 10 knots. Visibility greater than 10 miles. Sky clear. Temperature 70. Dew point 32. Altimeter 2963. 2963. Departure runway 03 right. Arrival runway 21 left. Visual approach is in use. Advise on initial contact, you have information alpha. Nellis information alpha. 1345 push button 2. Wing 210 at 10 knots. Roger. Captain, disconnect the power. Chief, turn off the ground power. Copy. I'm closing the canopy. Ground power is now off. Captain, disconnect air supply. Captain, disconnect air supply. Captain, disconnect external air. Chief, disconnect ground air supply. Check the emergency generator.
We're ready to taxi. Chester, push button free. Uh, okay. Chester, okay. turn ground taken. Just a push button for.
Just a push button six. Shut up. Attention to brief. This is the first flight of the Zone 5 campaign. The scenario is 1v1, one fighter versus one bandit. Sniper 3, you will be fighting Gator in Outlaw 4-2, and after this briefing you can get together with him for details. To simplify maintenance support, we only brought our F-16s and F-5s on this debt, so you will not see the A-4 Skyhawk. On this first flight, you'll face the F-5 Tiger II, which is a good simulator of the MiG-21. As far as weapons, both aircraft will use internal guns only. This will provide you with the most engaged time and the most intense learning experience. You've already had the Nellis Course Rules Lecture, so you should be comfortable operating here. But since this is your first flight of the program, Gator will be the lead. Your call sign will be Outlaw 42-2. The bandit will only lead this event. In the future, you or your wingman will be the flight lead. Before you arrive at the range, you will need to perform a G Awareness Maneuver, or G Warm. This is a requirement before every ACM training flight. I'm sure you do them in your squadron, and here's what we expect. You will be flying at least 300 knots preferably 350. When cleared, slide out two miles of beam. When you're stabilized, begin a smooth, firm pull 
to at least 4G and hold it for 90 degrees of turn. In case you're wondering, turn towards your flight lead. Ease the G in reverse, then again pull to at least 4G. Be sure to maintain sight throughout these maneuvers. When you've completed your second turn, call complete on the radio. Gator will knock out his G awareness maneuver when he can. Gator will check in with Blackjack, the range controller, and Showtime, the range training officer, at Gate 4, Bighorn. Then you will proceed to Point India. Once in the area, Gator will establish you at 23,000 feet and 350 knots. He will tell you to take separation and you'll move out to 1.5 miles. When you are established and ready to begin the fight, call Speed and Angels. Gator will then call for tape recorders and fights on. Give it your best turn in to accomplish the head-on pass. I'm sure you've already thought about your game plan, but be ready to evaluate what the bandit is doing. He may make a move that causes you to change your plan. Your F-14 is superior to the F-5 in almost every measure, but he can challenge you by giving up energy for angles, to intimidate you, or maybe get a shot, and by Just taking advantage of any mistakes you make. If the F-5 appears to be gaining, evaluate his energy as discussed in the 1v1 lecture. I hope you watch that video in preparing for this program. We expect you to operate as a crew. Rios, be ready to operate the dogfight modes of the radar, to tell your pilot airspeed, or do whatever it takes to make your Tomcat more lethal. In future events, we'll have a scenario and you'll be assigned a fighter mission, but not this time. The purpose of this flight is to concentrate on your close-in maneuvering skills. The first fight will continue until Gator calls knock it off, unless you experience a safety issue or run low on fuel, then you can call knock it off. After the knock it off, Gator will get a fuel check from you and then expect to re-establish the start parameters for the second engagement. When Gator calls RTB, join up and he will lead you back to Nellis. Remember, go ahead and switch the master arm on and actually take the shot at the bandit. It's a game and it's cool to blow stuff up. And the bandit pilot, well he'll be okay and he'll join you later at the club. Good luck. Let's review the training rules. We need 5 miles visibility and 15,000 feet between cloud layers. Hard deck is 500 feet. Soft deck is 5,000 feet. Just a select no slow point. speed, high AOA maneuvering below the soft deck. Of note, these numbers are for the game. The decks in actual flying are higher. You need to perform a G-awareness maneuver before starting ACM. All aircraft need operable UHF and ICS if two-seaters and must monitor guard. Nordo aircraft rock your wings and proceed to Coyote B, orbit at 15,000 feet. If no one joins on you, follow the Nordo recovery procedures in the in-flight guide. Remember, Monitor showtime and blackjack frequencies while on the range. There's a 500 foot bubble around all aircraft. 9,000 feet is the minimum for head on aim 9 shots. There's a 1,000 foot minimum for guns and no head on gun shots. Head on, pass left to left, but don't cross flight path to get there. Nose high aircraft goes high. Up sun aircraft is responsible for collision avoidance. Offensive aircraft monitor the altitude of a defensive aircraft. Don't make blind lead turns. Echo all knock it off calls. If someone's approaching guns on you, don't dispense flares. An additional note, monitor your fuel closely and remember we have two tankers on station if you get low on fuel. The details are on your kneeboard cards. There's no need to push the limits. Now take a minute to go through the stall spin procedures for your aircraft. Chester, push button 14.
approaching the range. Let's do the G1. Sniper 3, G warm. Okay, where is this bastard? Oh, there he is. Jesus Christ. Chester, select defense point. Fence 
Just so select initial point. Roger. Switching to initial point. Just a strike, surface strike. Okay, switching to surface target. Sniper 
Nine o'clock. Sniper three, speed and angels on the right. Alpha four two, speed and angels on the left. Recorders on the left. three sixty. Twelve o'clock. We're three ninety. Six o'clock. Speed three thirty. Three o'clock low. We're at two seventy. Okay. Two four zero knots. Nope. Staring down right low. on top of him. Passing three ten. Yeah, I got some couple hits. You got this. Shoot him. Oof. Bandit is going down. Ah, that was fast. That's a quick loop. Right on a six. Alright, just got a lot of gun and fuel. It's a nice quick kill. Okay, there he is. Chester, lock him up. Chester scan, 50 miles. Just to look him up. Okay, okay. Got him locked. Target, 15 miles. Alright, got him locked. Let's go for a quick tip fight. That's a F5. Geez, let's have the nut pull more G's than that. Just a break up. Roger that. Okay, we're on. Four zero zero knots. P 
Shoot him, shoot him! Closing! Three sixty knots. Nine o'clock low. Three twenty. Passing two eighty. One o'clock low. We're on a six. Shiny and chrome. Shot there and just spend some fuel to four hundred. Ten o'clock. Nine o'clock. Okay. Speed and angels on the right. Let's go. Alpha four two. Speed and angels on the left. Recorders on. Lights on. Eight o'clock. Three sixty knots. Twelve o'clock. Six o'clock. Passing three thirty. Seven o'clock. There it is. Going up. Going down. Two zero zero knots. Not the luck. Got the luck. Get on the six. Twelve o'clock low. Evil lead. Speed two eight zero. Passing 310. One o'clock. Circle on his six. And there we go. Speed at 370. Come on, show me some of that pilot shit. Speed 460. It's going. And that's 520. Speed is 550. He's right in front of you. 510 now. We're at 480. 440. 2 o'clock. Let's go up. 390. And go down. He's right there. Closing. One o'clock low. 360 knots. On his six. Time to clean him and fry him. 310, almost quarter speed. Turn her down. 340. Speed's looking 370. On a six, go get him. 400 balls of fire. That's so many awesome. balls. We're on a six. We're at 440. 470. Turn her down. 
A bit closer. This game, let's decrease ammo rate of fire. Super sleeper. Shoot him, shoot him. 380 knots. 420. Light him up, he's right in front of us. We're nifty at 450. Keep on skating. Speed 400. We're on a six. Shiny and chrome. 450. On a six. Go get him. 480. On a six. Go get him. We're on a six. Passing through 510. Oh, he's dead now. We're on a six. Shiny and chrome. Speed's 470. We're on a six. There's 420. You have him now. Right in front of us.
Ooh, piece of candy. Bingo fuel. 11 o'clock. Speed 360. So slippery. 320. Show me some of that pilot shit. Shoot him, he's right there! Honor 12, sharp! 450. He's on a 12-ish. He's ours now. Turn her down. Speed 420. 12 o'clock low. We're at 390. 360 knots. 12 o'clock. Looking like 310. Speed is 210. He's right in front of you. 230 knots. 280 knots. We have him now. Being around the fuel. Speed 330. Here. I smell a kill soon. We're on a six. Three eighty. Four two zero knots. Four six zero knots. Turn her down. We're on a six. Closing. Airspeed four ninety. Oh, Jesus Christ. And that's four. Oh, so slip. Six o'clock low. We need to find the next. I'm not talking about man. Four ten. To find the new way of Bandit killing them. Is going down. Because this was way not good. I mean, you should use more vertical. Make him uh, lose I energy or something. Just a tune, tak tak on. Okay, Roger. Just a select initial point. You got Damn, it was hard. It was slippery and small. There is a friendly 140, 25 miles, Angels 23. Yeah, I shouldn't engage in those weird 
Willst du? We have a friendly F5, 12 o'clock, two miles. There is okay. I don't have time really to uh, play around, look for him. I need to fuel. Just a select defense point. Okay. Just a two and tactic again. Yep.
Okay. Just a turn right here too. Copy that. Texaco, one, one. Pontiac, one, one. Request rejoin. Chester scan 20 miles out. Chester scan 20 miles. Chester scan 25 miles. Welcome. Contact. Cleared contact. Just a bit to the right. Just a bit to the right. Little left. Slowly, slowly. Contact. We're taking fuel. Taking fuel.
Fuel 2000. Thousand. Yeah, right, like four thousand five hundred would be enough. Fuel four thousand. Alright, that's enough. Disconnecting. Support rejoin. Whoops. Just a yeah, scan, 50 miles. Man. Roger. Just a wrench was coming. Get it there. Oh, he was. Alright. Tell me another. We've locked a friendly. Just a break line. Roger that. Infected and more. If the flight admin procedures seem complex, don't worry, you'll get used to them. You'll have a few relatively quiet minutes each flight while you RTB. Take the time to think about how it went and get yourself ready for the debrief. Think about your game plan. You should always start with a game plan, although you may have to adjust it once things get going. Was it a good plan? How well did you execute? How well did you adjust? In this 1v1, did Gator show you any surprises? The F-14 is superior to the F-5, but Gator knows a few tricks that can intimidate a Tomcat pilot in Rio if they don't have good SA of their own energy state and the F-5's energy. The debrief will go over the flight in detail and will emphasize learning points. It's an extremely valuable part of the fighter tactics and weapons program. We're bingo fuel. Just a push button eleven. Alrighty. Just a push button eleven. Roger that. In Bravo. One four four five Zulu. Wing 210 at 10 knots. Visibility greater than 10 miles. Sky clear. 
temperature 73 dew point 34 altimeter 2963 no zig departure runway 03 right just a select step one two arrival runway 21 left yes, sir. Switching visual to approach is in use advise on initial contact you have information bravo Nellis information bravo one four four just a five push zero. button six wing two one zero at ten knots Outlaw 42 flight, switch button 6. Dash 2, button 6. Just a slight step on three. Okay, let's make some separation before he turns. Unexpectedly. And Exactly what I was afraid. I must crash into it. Roger, reduce speed, maintain 250 knots.
There's the nose. Just to select home base. Where we go? Switching to home base. Just a push button for Alrighty. Traffic, C-17, 1 o'clock, high, 10 and miles. Anyway. Just switch to save. Roger. Okay. Okay. Feet. 
300 feet. Just a push button down. See what other fives do. You're um, way too fast. I don't know what the hell I used to do. stuff.
All right. Thank you for event one. If you enjoyed it. And I hope you will see you in event two. Catching the skies. Fly safe.